Good morning, Dennis. Good morning. Well, you don't look exactly like a bright new dollar. I feel all right, Father. Are oh, you having a good time? In a swell honesty. Met some nice young people? A couple of good guys and some gals. What? Girls. Are they a lot of fun? Sure. Well, then let's bring them around the house this evening. We could have a wiener roast or something. Kid stuff. Say, listen, let's talk about my allowance again, huh, Dad? All right. I need five dollars. Five dollars? Well, that's a lot of money. Yeah, I know it is, but, but I gotta have it. What for? Well, well, for things. Now, look, Andy. When you're earning your own money, you won't ever have to explain to anybody. Theoretically, that is. But when you're spending someone else's, it's only fair to the partner that's supplying it to know where it's going. Now, that's logical, isn't it? Gee, Pa, sometimes I wish you weren't a judge. Why? Because it's kind of taking advantage of a guy to keep showing him two sides of a question. Well, you don't want to be blind in one eye, do you? No. I want that five dollars awful bad. Funny. You never needed that much money back home when you were showing Polly around. Well, she was... How'd you know it was for a girl? Because I was your age once myself. Yeah, but you and Mom were different. Not much. I want enough money once to hire a horse and buggy, take a girl riding, because I suspected that uh, she might let me kiss her if I got her far enough away from home. You mean Mom? No. This was somebody that I had no business being with. Well, what happened? Nothing. By the time I got the money to hire the horse and buggy, I wasn't interested. Oh. They don't use a horse and buggy nowadays. 